Hello, Jess Sugood here, and today we're taking a look at the LEGO Ninjago 2020 Kai Avatar Arcade Pod, which has 49 pieces, too many figures, and retails for $10 in the United States. LEGO sent me this set for free, but all opinions in this video are my own. The exclusive minifigure of this set is Avatar Kai, and this design has a new torso print, a new face print, and I think new legs as well. Also, my favorite part is a new and exclusive color for the LEGO Ninjago movie hair piece. This design does have a little reference to it. You get it? He's Cobra Kai. Uh, huh? Uh. <laughs> but other than that, there's no alternate facial expression, unfortunately. The next minifigure is the not so exclusive, but still cool Digikai, which does come in a lot of the sets, but this is the cheapest way to get him. This design does have some new pieces, like a new mask piece, this new controller piece for his weapon, and this new sword holder, which holds this sign at the back, the sign being a name tag for Kai, though each of the ninja use the same name tag where it doesn't show any name or anything, but rather, I guess it shows their health. But with all that garb removed, underneath you can see his face printing, which is a new face for 2020, as is this alternate expression, which I like that it's just a generic Kai face and not one with the mask, so you could have it both ways. If you haven't seen my Lloyd Pod review, each of these arcade pods use the same pieces, and that is an unprinted new frame for the arcade cabinet. You do put these stickers on, which I like that they have stickers in this set because that means you could get these pieces unprinted and customize them as you'd like. So there's a sticker on this side, on this bottom, and at this side. Then a sticker on this two by four tile for the buttons to control the arcade cabinet. That tile just sticks onto these two by four spacing of studs, total of eight studs at the front. And then at the back, there's this new clamshell-like design, which is a whole separate piece that attaches onto these clips on the arcade pod. And two studs just go onto this latch here. And once opened, you can see there's all these pieces for that Kai avatar. And at the front of this arcade interior, there's more pieces to complete the avatar build with the torso and legs. The regular Digikai just kind of stands on this pedestal here, which makes it easy to see him from the front. One thing I don't like about this design is that they don't have, uh, I guess, the right proportions for a minifigure to play this arcade cabinet. Take any minifigure and you'll see that they're a lot smaller than the height of where the controls are at. So you're going to have to make them use a pedestal, which I guess in real life, some arcade cabinets do have a little stool to sit on to play it. So it's not a big deal. But that's it for the build of the set. Let's take a look at the packaging and then the final verdict. The boxes for these arcade pod sets are actually really cool where they take an arcade design. There's some features at the back highlighted and even some artwork at the side. And for some reason, these instructions have like a higher level of effort than other Ninjago sets where they have this special background, this artwork of the figures at certain steps. And to the back, there's some more details on how you could customize the set. There's also a small poster as well as this back section that advertises the two other pods and the win logo, yay. Oh, and I almost forgot. The set gives extra stickers to customize your pod with. So overall, you guys know I love each of these arcade pod sets and each of them are great in the same way where you get this fantastic arcade cabinet build, two minifigures, one of which is exclusive and they all have exclusive color hair pieces and they're only $10. There's great value here. There's great play here with that arcade build and I wanna see people customize that and I don't have too much else to say. A from me, I love these. But that's it for now. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys later. Peace out.